Hey Cancers, this is your weekly reading for July 8th through the 14th. Let's go ahead and jump in with each other. Hope all of you guys are doing well out there, taking care of yourself. Let's see what's showing up with your energy here. Okay, I'm going to shuffle these cards while we talk a little astrology. So July 8th, July 8th, Venus will sextile Uranus. Uh, also July 8th, Mercury will sextile Jupiter. Okay, it's a very active day for you guys to get social, connect with some people, focus on long-term goals and projects during that time. There's something big happening July 9th. I want you to pay attention to these dates, okay? July 9th, Jupiter will sextile the true node. This is good for my practitioners, meditation, um, people that practice meditation and prayer, okay? Prayer warriors out there. Uh, this is a very uh, pivotal time for you guys, the practitioners, meditation and prayer warriors out there to um, have your prayers answered. <clears throat> Or there's going to be a sense of unity experience between these groups, okay? For astrologers, July 9th with Jupiter sextile in the true north node. Uh, for astrologers, any spiritual work is very powerful during this time, okay? It's a powerful alignment for you guys to enhance your intuition at this time. Download insights, reach deeper wisdom, okay? And for everyone else that don't practice those things, this is still a good time for you guys to channel um, some energy at this time, okay? I'm just getting out your cards so we can see what's showing up for you. So that is July 8th, all right? July 10th. The sun will trine Saturn. It's going to be a very grounding energy. Promotes efficiency and productivity. Sound judgment. That will have a duration of two days. One or two days before or after you guys may be feeling this energy of being very stable here. Cancer, okay? Uh, July 11th, Venus will go into... Leo. So this is a good time for connections, relationships, going deeper in feelings in regards to love, feeling close to your family. Yes, definitely. This is a time to enjoy romantic partnerships or atmospheres around you. Great time to be an artist, to be artistic. To really dive into your creative side. It's a productive time for artists. July 11th. Okay. Venus going into Leo. Got a lot of dogs showing up in your reading. Can mean a lot of loyalty that's going to be around you here, Cancer, at this time. I'm going to bring out one more card for you. Okay. Last date. July 12th. Venus will be in opposition to Aquarius. It's a little rough, okay? Pluto's moving, uh, not opposition to Aquarius, okay? Pluto is going to be one degrees of Aquarius, but Pluto will be going back, dipping back into Capricorn for the last time in your lifetime here, okay? So that is going to bring uh, a lot of things to the head. It's like, I don't know why they're showing me that picture. <laughs> okay, a picture of a pimple, and you know how you have a white head on there, and you're like, oh, that's ready to pop, or I need to get rid of that. Yeah, a lot of things are going to be exposed. So this period here when Pluto changes signs are is known as the big shift uh, in the collective energy. And um, it really exposes the dirty laundry. Collapses of big corporations, institutions, government structures, anybody that's that has ill will and intention, they're going to be exposed. Okay? at this time or continue to be exposed because this this has been happening already so you might see a lot of exposures in your connections and your relationships here this week i feel like it's, it's spanning over a week here but you guys this is a weekly reading all right so um 
Yeah. Pluto going back into Capricorn will increase extremes and ruthless behaviors and people that are untrustworthy. Okay. So let's go into your tarot energy here. What is wrong? You guys have the Five of Cups coming in. You have the Page of Pentacles. Um, you have the King of Cups that's showing up for you. So something's bothering you at this time. Cancer. I don't know what it is. Let's see here. Okay. Let's go into your energy here. It feels like something's bothering you. You have Stranger that's coming in towards you here. You guys could be thinking about past because that's what the Five of Cups is. You can see him looking down at the cups that have fallen. So it's something that has already ended or something that you already lost. You may still be thinking about that stuff. Okay. But it always shows the two cups behind him is what you truly need to turn around and focus on. You are protected at this time and you need to go toward, you need to work on your goals right now and not not have your energy so focused on past situations that haven't worked out for you or things that have happened in the past here cancer um, this stranger card is making me feel like there may be someone coming into your life here that um may be trustworthy with the king of cups that is showing up for you it feels like someone that's trustworthy because clarifying this stranger card you have um secret admirer interesting so you guys have a secret admirer here coming into your life it's a stranger an unfamiliar person a potential ally that's what this stranger is potential threat as well it could be a potential threat but i feel like with all the cards on the table it's showing me a lot of happiness for you so whoever this is they may be a potential ally they may bring in something good something beneficial here in your life and that's why i'm telling you to turn your focus away from things that you have lost here this week this is a period of renewal and a period where new things are going to enter into your life and you need to nurture those new things it could be a new job it could be a new position it could be a new person here uh, it could be someone that's going to make a difference in your life that's showing up as a stranger here but they come in with um a lot of direction they come in with a caring heart here this person like i said it could be a new romantic love for you here cancer or someone that is showing up as a secret admirer of yours that wants to assist you a start of a relationship uh in any sense is what's being clarified with this stranger that's what it means an unknown visitor but this unknown visitor doesn't feel like their ill wills or they have ill will against you with this uh king of cups here this person is coming in very logical and very practical someone that may be coming in as a wise mentor um towards you here or someone that uh is very respected so it could be like a colleague it could also be a woman here as well that's going to be helping you. Maybe an older woman here, Cancer, said dealings or relationship with the older woman. So it could be a masculine or feminine energy. Um, it could be a divine masculine or divine feminine energy here. Someone new that's coming into your life, okay? I do see a lot of support around you because I said I, there's a lot of dogs showing up. You have dogs, a dog far away, a distant friend is thinking of you here as well. Someone, you may get an invite here, okay? To come out and spend time with someone because you have flying high. You may, this may be someone you lost contact with. I'm switching gears here because it feels like there's someone that's going to be contacting you. It could be like a childhood friend or someone that you knew from college or knew from high school. It's someone that you may have worked with here. They may be stopping in town or this person wants you to come visit them. I see planes, trains, buses, like you traveling here. A lot of dogs showing up. So you're going to have a lot of loyal people around you or people that want to show loyal to you or people that want to get together with you. You have dogs again getting together with friends. It could be old friend and it also has just the dog. Okay, a little pity there. <laughs> yeah. Some of you guys have some very powerful friends or you're going to make some very powerful friends here. Okay, King of Cups that's showing up for you. 
friends in high places. You have older woman, okay, that's coming in as well. Someone that's very wise. Protection from a powerful friend. They want to befriend you, but you're going to be flying high here, Cancer. That's what I'm saying. On top of the world. That's what this card means. A heightened perspective, an awe-inspiring view, an apex, a great feeling, doing one's best. That's what you're doing. And you're doing a fantastic job. Realizing one's power. This is what spirit wants you to do here because you've gone through a, a long journey. I feel like you guys have gone through this journey. You're continuing to move through life. A long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser at the end. So all your experience are, is being counted for. All of your trials and tribulations, spirit is seeing you at this time. So realizing one's power, succeeding, that's what you're going to experience here um, or move into. I feel like a lot of you guys may be moving into this energy here and fairly quickly with the page of pentacles that's showing up for you and the flying high card that's coming in. They're also letting me know that something may come in towards you or someone and you need to move quickly uh, to get. Uh, gain an upper hand or not gain an upper hand I don't want to say it like that to um, take up an opportunity that's what it feels like you have the knight of swords and a page of pentacles here okay so I feel like there may be an opportunity available to you here by someone that's very wise someone that's very professional possibly here um, and they want to do business with you or bring you in on a team okay but this is going to be a win-win situation for you okay succeeding winning flying high, feeling invincible or untouchable, <laughs> okay? This is going to bring you great happiness. That's what's clarifying this flying high card. Something that's going to bring you a lot of joy, a lot of happiness here, okay? Um, jubilation and an elevated individual here. The pilot. I see, that's why I said I see you guys flying here, okay? Not only flying high with success in your life, but also maybe even taking flight because I feel like you're needing to go somewhere. And that's why you have a distant friend is thinking of you. Now, this person may become a friend. It may be someone new in your life or this may be someone that you know already, but there's some great opportunity somewhere where you're meant to go. These plans may just be formed this week. Or you guys may have plans to go somewhere. You may be there already, okay? But there's going to be a great opportunity um, that you're going to notice or experience or be presented with um, in that place, okay, where you're being asked to move mentally or physically for you, okay? Spirit is saying with the egg here, Cancer, that there is a lot of success in your life. You're going to experience a lot of success here in your life. Success assured what good plans and hard work is here for you. There's some amazing announcement coming in. I told you some great message that's showing up for you. Let's go ahead and close this reading. Because <laughs> that, that energy here, I feel, is very promising for you. We're going to see what message spirit wants to leave you with at this time. Cancer. Okay. Woo, I told you. So you guys have some important event that's coming in. Commitment. Now, this could be a personal relationship, romantic one for you guys, or this could be, uh, like I said, a romantic one, or because you have a secret admirer here and a stranger. <laughs> this person may not be your usual type. Like, you may not go for this person here, for some of you guys. You may not go for this person, but... Well, they you wouldn't usually go for a person like this, but you should, okay? There's something fantastic about them. There's something really real about them. And you have someone with the, in their, this is sitting right over the King of Cups. Whoever this is, they have good intentions and they want to commit to you or make a commitment to you, okay? Or they want you to enter into a contract or a professional commitment with you here, event. Let's see exactly what this is for you. We're going to read just a little bit about this to get the full effect of this card. Because we like facts over here. We like to know exactly what's going on. So someone's about to make a promise to you. Okay. 
make a promise sign on the dotted, dotted line this card shows a man signing papers at a table and it foretells a commitment on the horizon cancer it may in fact be in the form of a romantic relationship or even a marriage for some of you there could also be a business commitment a job offer a partnership a rental agreement or the sale of a house all these activities um are coming in time for you okay just in a nick of time for you this card uh also may also signify a good resolution to a legal matter for you especially one that you've been dealing with for a while of course you still need to do your research and get a clear understanding of your part in this commitment they're asking you to investigate what's expected of you here cancer and what you can expect of every anyone else involved okay being well informed will help you uh, help the new endeavor go smoothly indeed being prepared and informed helps all area in all areas of life the universe blesses your commitments as you bring your personal power and highest intention to all that you do you're going to be really flying high on something i see you guys entering into homes i just saw a home or, or an apartment they just showed me like um so you guys are going to have an opportunity to move by water a large body of water that's what i just saw through that door it's like a glass door maybe in a high rise because the building was high okay so you guys may have an opportunity to do that move by a large body of water here so something good is coming in towards you you're, the office is either there or your home is going to be there you're going to be feeling that's why this is in the sky like you're on top of the world sitting on top of the world yes <laughs> okay that's what i'm seeing here all blessings to you your energy looks good here cancer um and it's all starting this week right let's uh close out your reading here i appreciate you guys uh, for coming to watch your reading make sure you leave me a comment uh, uh, in the comment section make sure you guys also if you want to support me in this channel give this reading a thumbs up for me that's all you got to do that's all I'm asking for is to give this reading a thumbs up so it can work here work hard for me on YouTube okay make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and hit that notification bell so you know when I come back with another reading sometimes I don't work it doesn't always work, okay? Hitting that notification bell. Just come back because I always got something new, okay? Either under the video section or the live section. I'm going to be here for you guys, okay? I will see you in your next reading. Take care, loves. Have a fantastic day. Bye.